Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. So in today's video, I'm finally going to be doing my lip swatch. I know you guys have been asking me about this, but I'm finally doing my swatches and review of the new ColourPop Luxe lipsticks. So I only picked up four shades, and of the four shades, I think I think I did a pretty good job with my shade selection because these are colors that I could definitely see myself wearing um, without it being, you know, without it looking crazy on me. So, um, the shades that I picked up were Pinkies Up, 27, Sitting Pretty, and On Display. So, I think they came out with 24 shades, and these are $7 a piece, which y'all know ColourPop always have, like, affordable things on their site anyway. So, I thought that was a really good price for a lipstick. And I just went on their website, and some of the colors that I'm showing you in this video are currently sold out. But lately, they've been restocking on them, so hopefully they they'll go ahead and do another restock so you guys can get your hands on the colors that I'm going to be sharing if you like these colors. So really quickly, these lipsticks do come in a white box and on the top of the box they have the color of the shades and also the name of the shades, which I think is really nice. And as far as the lipstick itself, as you can see, it's in a really cute rose gold packaging and it has little stars all around the packaging, which I think is really cute. But enough about the packaging, I'm sure you guys are here to see what these lipsticks look like on me and just to hear my thoughts on the product itself. So the very first shade I want to share is in the shade Pinkies Up and this is the one that's supposed to be their limited edition shade. It is described as a dusty mid-tone mauve. So this is a color that I could wear by itself but I personally would like to pair it with a brown lip liner. As you can see, I did swatch it so you guys can see how it looks like without a lip liner. And then later on, I went ahead and popped on a lip liner from ColourPop and it is in the shade K. All right, this next one is called Sitting Pretty. So this one is described as a muted fuchsia and it's just a really pretty bright purple. I love purple lipstick, like purple liquid lipstick, purple lipsticks, purple glosses. I love this type of purple on my skin tone. I just feel like I can definitely get away with this shade. All right, this next one is in the shade On Display and it's just a true red. You can never have too many reds in your collection and I just love how bright and vibrant this is. Perfect for those holiday parties, perfect for the summertime, springtime, fall time, anytime. And like I said, you can never have too many red lipsticks in your collection. All right, and the very last one that I picked up is the one that I have on my lips right now and it is in the shade 27. So this one is described on the website as a deep plummy beige. I do like it. I love how deep the shade is. This is also one of my favorite ones that I picked up. Now as far as how they feel on the lips, they do glide on very, very creamy, very smooth, very easily. I didn't have a problem with applying the darker shades. They didn't really bleed around the outside of my lips. Um, as I'm talking, they still feel really comfortable on the lips. Once I applied it the first time, it does have like a, a hint of shine to it, but as it sits on the lips longer and longer, it starts to kind of dry down to a kind of like a satin matte finish. So it's very comfortable on the lips. It does transfer though. So as you can see, it does transfer, which is expected for a, you know, a lipstick. But other than that, I really like how it feels on the lips. Very comfortable. Um, I have not worn these all day, so I can't really tell you guys how they wear throughout the whole entire day. But so far, I'm loving them. And I will be sure to let you guys know if these shades are still available by the time this video goes up so you guys can get your hands on them. But yeah, I think that is everything I have. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you thumbs it up and do not forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.